Good evening, everyone. Happy Friday to you guys. I hope you done had a, a good day so far. Uh, today, I came to uh, share my uh, Fish Fry Friday with you guys. Uh, I'm not going to do a tutorial, the tour, uh, tutor, a demonstration on doing my shrimps because that's the only thing that I haven't um, I haven't showed you guys uh, how to do because I've had requests for them and I I know I got requests you guys but I'm gonna do them I'm going to do the shrimps but I don't I don't have the um, ingredients that I want to do the batter with on my shrimps the way I normally do them I do them this way cuz you know when I uh, I have several different ways that I prepare stuff but I always just try to give you the, the, the best one out of uh, my stockpile of recipes. Well, anyway, um, before I get started, you guys, I want to do a couple of shout outs. I had some subscribers to ask me uh, what channels, I mean, what channels do I watch and different stuff like that. Uh, I had uh, a couple of emails with you guys asking me that. And um, every time I do a video, I just, I forget a lot of them because um, when I did my uh, Easter share, my Easter deal, which I mean dinner with you guys, I wanted to uh, shot, uh, do this shout out on this lady that uh, I started watching. She came to my channel and subscribed and uh, I, I seen that she have a YouTube channel and I went back and uh, I went and checked her channel out and I have really fell in love with it. She is just what, huh, just what I like. I'm a, I'm a, I am a simple person, and a very, a sort of low key person. Even though I like to have fun and joke and stuff, but um, the stuff that I, uh, I watch is mostly uh, low key. If you guys remember, in one of the videos I told y'all I used to watch. I, I think I watched every Bob Newhart show it used to be. I mean that he put out uh when he was running his uh. Um, television program back in the uh, 70s and my son my son used to sit up and watch it with me if I didn't tell you guys that I think I told that lady I told the uh, uh, Blake grandmother Brenda hi you guys tell, tell Blake I said hello and I hope he's still watching me well anyway I want to give a shout out to this lady she is a very nice lady and I and I hope you guys go over to her channel and um and, and uh, support her channel because she's uh, she just real nice and I think that her channel needs support. A lot of these uh, smaller YouTubers like myself, we don't get uh, supported like a lot of the larger ones do. And I, I, I'm just assuming that my subscribers probably have close to the same kind of taste that I have since, they, uh, since all you guys like my old landmark style cooking. But uh, the name of her channel is uh, Grandma Sandy. Grandma Sandy. And if you go over to her channel, um, tell her that I sent you guys her way. Tell her that May May sent you. She's a nice lady. She would appreciate it. And uh, and you know, I just I just really like uh, I, I like uh, watching her channel. I wasn't gonna try to do a shout out do shout outs until until my daughter would um, be home so she can drop the links and stuff down in the description box so you'll know so just if you can't remember the name that I t I'm saying just go back and review the video because this video is not going to be long and the other person that um, I want to shout out is uh, Denise Jordan uh, the name of her channel is De Denise Jordan this and that and guess what you guys I was intent to write this down so I wouldn't forget it but I thought it was gonna be so quick I was hoping my little old mind stayed on it just that long you know but when you start uh, when you get a particular age I'm gonna tell you that mind is not as sharp as it uh, was when you was in your when you was in the prime in your prime I used to have a very sharp mind but I thank God for what I got now because I know it's um, could uh, 
could be worse. And another lady, I call this lady, another channel I want to shout out. And then I'm going to be through with the shout outs for this, for the uh, channels, uh, for this video. And then probably when I do, um, my juice video, I do a couple of more shout outs. Um, the other channel that I want to shout out is called, uh, Mama Ray Ray. I don't know. I, I think it may be Mama Ray Ray Kitchen or Mama Ray Ray. Um, I, when I, I put it, I'll, I'll do a comment and pin it and put the names of these channels in there. I can do that, you guys. I, I do know I can do that little, uh, uh. Uh, that much of technology because you know a lot of you guys know that I I enjoy answering your comments and um, you're probably saying oh my god she, she wrote a long comment so that's what I wanted to do you guys I want to I want to you know I like sharing and I'd like to be a help to any uh, anyone I can and um, I think that's what it's all about and, and like I say, you if, if you're not doing some of these uh, uh, smaller YouTube channels, you may be missing a, a lot of helpful stuff and um, and some blessings. Because like, like I, now, uh, Grandma Sandy, that she inspired my, um, uh, that little table scape that I did uh, on Easter Sunday. And I just love her, you guys. She do, the, she do like a... a Two place setting, cause I don't. I watched a lot of uh, table skates, and they be real large, beautiful table skates. But uh, like I told you guys, I am a simple person, but I like all that stuff. I don't have nothing against it. I sit up there and watch it. But uh, since I have um, started my own channel, I try to. I, I really support the channels that support me, because you know them larger people, the larger channels, they got a lot. They got a lot of subscribers. And I know what it's, you know, because I was on here for over a year or so before, uh, you know, I was, I got monetized and got enough subscribers cause to uh, to do my YouTube channel. And that's what Miss uh, uh, Denise Jordan is about. She is so helpful. If you starting a, a YouTube channel or thinking about starting a YouTube channel, me and her is closer in age, but I, you know, but she she just she knows a lot about that stuff. I can always get a lot of helpful tent, uh, tips from her. And um, so if you're thinking about starting a YouTube channel, that's that you definitely need to go and try. I mean, check her out. And she also do household tips. Oh my God, she really can do that. She's got like a, a variety of stuff. She do cooking, and she do gardening, and like I say, she do um. Cause she shot me out one on once on her channel, and I had been meaning to, uh, you know, I don't, you know, return the favor, but, but I think she's good. That's I, I think that's you know she's a good channel anyway, and deserve us, you know, anybody support that wanna go over there and do. Cause, uh, um, like I say, uh, small YouTubers and stuff have good content. People watch what they wanna watch, but. Uh, I just stick to what I do because I don't copy and go in behind people channel and I have had uh, um, some of the people you know that I correspond with uh, with doing the uh, emails they be telling me you know different things you know they help me about what I need to know about uh, the YouTube putting contents and stuff out and whatever I said well, you know what I, I'm going to leave all that up to God with the uh, all of that, and that's all, that's all. That's all I'm going on that. But let me share my uh, dinner with you guys, cause Tuck probably ready to eat and probably said, "I thought you said you ain't gonna do it in about five minutes." Okay, these are the baked fries. You remember I did a video on that for um for for Blake, my uh, youngest viewer. Hey Blake, is you enjoying your grandmother and your parents while you're out of school? May May said hello. And okay, this is some um, this is some shrimps. They like they were supposed to be large, but you guys can see them not lot uh, large shrimps. And this is some hush puppies. Those hush puppies, hush puppies, I just got them. They're great bays. I got them at Walmart. Nothing special about that. And you know, guys, I I got a uh, I got a video up with the uh, 
catfish and I got a video up with the uh, fries. So all I got to do is when I get back started uh, cooking real, uh, real good after everything is over with. You know, not over with, but when we start getting back to some normalcy and uh, and um, uh, and every, and I continue to, to have uh, be well, and you guys too. I'm praying for y'all every day. I'm praying for all of us. I'm praying for the whole world because we don't know what happened, but God knows. And whatever it was, He gave. He He He, he stopped because the way they talk when I listen to um. The briefing every day, this could have been worth. This could have been awful. All of us could have been affected by it. I mean, it could have been just that bad. Um, cause uh I had when I was in when I was in uh when I was in my uh teaching training continuing education class, they um uh, I had to have uh so many hours every uh Every, excuse me, every two years before I would have my, before my license and stuff could be renewed. And um, we had a scientist to come in from, uh, he was with the federal, uh, maybe maybe the CDC, because we have somebody from the states or whoever keeping us up on the disease and how we're supposed to, you know, conduct that and what we're supposed to train on in the classroom with students. And uh, he told me, uh, he was he was telling Gary, you can remember when I when I came when I had uh, that scientist was telling us about that the year, and when I came out of there, I was shook because yeah, I, I had never I, I had never heard uh, heard of a, a, a pan what is a pandemic? Uh, you can now better than I can pandemic pandemic. I had I you know I heard of the epidemics and all the contagious cause they told us that and if it did it had bypassed me and we were saying that because I tell you back then I know this was cause this was before my daughter was born. This was in the um the um eighties. And I was thinking, I'm like, oh my god, and, and the way he told it we hadn't really uh it was back in the early nineteen hundreds and stuff. Maybe closer. I don't even know if my mama was born. My daddy might have been born, but I don't know if my mama was born when he said what year that something that was so, you know, wiped out a lot of people. But I was thinking, oh God, I hope we never see nothing like that. So I know a lot of you guys probably know just how blessed we are to still be here. And my prayers go out to the family that has lost their loved one and affected with it and all the people that sick with it. Uh, you y'all got a lot of people praying for you. You know, you know the, the scripture tell it don't take one but one or two, but it's a lot of people's praying, and I feel that they they know that they know that this is God's grace that still got us going. What the adversary try to do to us, but God's grace still got us here. So we got to continue to pray and heed to His word and make a change. Okay, so let me get back to what I'm saying. Um, this is a chit chat video, okay? What uh, I done told you, I told you guys that the catfish. You know, I did a video on it. Go back and look that video up, and um, if you want to do that, and then let me show y'all guys this. Now I don't know how many of y'all do this, but um, when me and Tucker have fish, I just put me some cucumbers up there just to have something green, cause normally we have some coleslaw, but these are some uh, bread and butter pickles, and you I have some um hamburger chips in here too but uh i didn't have any of them and then this is some sweet onion is this a vidalia onion gary no. he had to go it's not no it's just a regular sweet onion yes so onion. it's a sweet onion and then we got our normal condiments and stuff the malt vinegar the uh um tartar sauce i like the tartar sauce on my hush puppies and then we got the uh, cocktail sauce for our shrimps and then we got our drink over there. And that's what we're going to have, you guys. And um, Tuck really been enjoying that cake. And that's all I want to say for now. I just wanted to share my uh, Friday fish fry with you guys. Because I told you I've been I, I've been had time to think. And and then when I read y'all comments and everything, I so go, ooh. I, I'm just enjoying it. It's been helping keeping my mind off it because uh. I wanted to go out into my story shed and uh, 
and uh, try to look up some of my recipe books and all that stuff. But I got three uh, sheds out there. And uh, they are not, uh, it'll probably, probably take me three years to go through there and find it. Because I can't even remember, the stuff been out there so long, I can't remember where, I, where, it's, where, where it's at. All I know is I had it. So, I'm going to end this up video, you guys. And uh, to my new subscribers, I, I, I appreciate you uh, joining my channel. And this is my family now. This is uh, this what we going through now because I I, I have the uh, some of the nicest subscribers, and I'm I'm just really enjoying them. So I'm glad you joined y'all. You the new ones. I'm glad you joining up uh, my YouTube channel. And I hope that you can uh, go back and review my old uh, my uh, other videos and find something that you can use. This is a simply a simple channel, but and I try to bring you. Uh, uh, cooking the cooking uh, technique that I use is like old school it's like foundational fundamental of cooking and you can just go in because I feel once you know the basics if you get the basics and stuff right you learn a lot of that right, uh, right uh, learn that how you're supposed to what it takes to cook and break down your meats and your vegetables and all that how to cook it you can go in and add your own seasoning that uh to make it your own now all this stuff about i i try to give you measurements and times and, and times uh how long stuff takes to cook or normally takes to cook and all that stuff by the size of your meat or your pot and whatever now because some people say they don't do measurements and all of that um Help yourself if you don't do measurements and don't do uh, time your food. Because all of them older cooks back there in them days, uh, I got a story to tell y'all about that one day. And, and if I don't remember to tell you, uh, um, I uh, y'all remind me of it. I got to tell you why they, they, don't, they say they don't use recipes and all that. You ever thought about it? Might not have been no recipes. They created and started the recipes and all that. And then, uh, you know, they, they had a uh, had it in their head how to do things. And but if you don't have an idea of uh, you know flour and stuff go in it, uh, you don't know to put one cup or two cup or the whole bag. You got to have some kind of direction, a foundation to put anything on if you want it to stand. So I want to say, you guys, uh, that's all I'm gonna say for now. I you know I plan on starting my little. Uh, uh, chit chats and stuff for the ones that want it and the other ones that don't want it they can just exit to the left because like I told y'all I, I think I have told some of you in my uh, uh, in the comments and stuff my motto is if I can uh, if I can help just one person in this here YouTube chat and this on this YouTube two channel or just my journey in life I feel my living won't be in vain I know I can't help the masses but I feel I prayed before I started this channel and now that I got on there so many people is coming to me with these comments and stuff cuz I was I, I was like I don't know why God had brought me uh, to this channel he know that and look what we're going through now it's it's good to know that you know how to can you can come, go in your kitchen and prepare some beans and pair, uh, and make a meal out of some rice and grits or whatever. I mean rice and beans and the simple stuff. And uh and, and I, I think I'm talking to my husband because a lot of you guys have been asking, uh, could you know he give you some garden tips or show the garden and all that kind of stuff. Usually his garden, he just be uh, doing what he doing. I uh, you know. It ain't in no kind of order, but he said that he, I think when he read that card that lady gave him in, at Easter, and uh, with all this stuff going on, and uh, I really think that, uh, is you kind of thinking about it, Gary, considering it? Yeah, well, I'm thinking about it. I'm working on it. Well, I sure hope you do. And uh, now, I, I'm not, I don't do, I don't do help in the garden too much. I. After he gathered and bring it in the house, I work on it there. But uh, 
I told him, I said, if it's any kind of way you can, we, you know, because I got another little small camera and stuff where he could sit up out there. And I said, I ain't got to be standing out there in that heat. I'm not supposed to be in a whole lot of heat. Well, you guys, I have said enough. And I didn't want this to be no more than about 15 or 20 minutes. So, uh, and I know my husband's ready to eat. I'm sorry, Gary. I didn't mean to take that long. But you know I get so excited when I get to talking. So, I'm going to see you guys in my next video. Bye.